forever. Every 5th of May, cities around the world celebrate the vibrant culture of Mexico. Cinco de Mayo festivities stretch from Japan to Canada, from Jamaica to Australia, and beyond as well. It is on this day where you can enjoy music and Mexican food and many other things. People often mistake Mexican Independence Day when Cinco de Mayo actually commemorates the victory of the Mexican army over the French at the Battle of Puebla in 1862. Part of the rich cultural heritage of Mexico is folklore and superstitions. Have you ever heard of La Llorona? Fortunately, not all Mexican traditions are so gloomy. On today's Feedback Learnix, we will look at the 12 most popular superstitions of Mexican culture. Let's get to it. Number one, be careful when you sweep. Don't sweep the floor overnight or you will attract bad luck. Don't sweep dirt out the front door either or good luck will go with it. Avoid sweeping over the feet of a single person or you can sweep away any possibility of marriage. Number two, don't rub the palm of your hand when you have an itch. The itch always predicts good luck, so avoid rubbing it because if you do, you will send the money away. Instead, put coins or dollar bills in your palm and press until the itch goes away. Similarly, if you hit your elbow, it means that you will receive a surprise. So don't rub away the area that causes the pain. Number three, are you trying to get rid of guests you don't want to receive? Place a broom upside down behind the front door to keep them away. Number four, never put your wallet or purse on the floor. It is said that if you do it, it brings bad luck and costs lots of money. Number five, did you have a nightmare? Share your fear by telling someone your nightmare or it will come true. However, if it is a pleasant dream, don't tell anyone. Otherwise, it will not come true. Number six, don't let them stare or fondle your baby for too long. By doing so, they could curse you with the evil eye, which causes the baby to cry uncontrollably and start to have a fever or worse. Number seven, pay attention the next time someone hands you the salt. According to the legend of La Mal Sal, giving salt by hand directly brings bad luck. To avoid this, have someone put the salt back on the table before you pick it up. Number eight, avoid cutting your baby's hair when he is very young. If you do it before he starts walking, it will take him longer to master the skill. If you cut his hair before his first year, he will never learn to speak. Number nine, place a glass filled with water on the refrigerator or behind the door to absorb negative energies in the home. Number 10, are your ears ringing? Someone could be talking about you. If your right ear is buzzing, you should not worry. They are speaking well of you. On the other hand, if your left ear buzzes, they are talking bad about you. In that case, you should bite your tongue. According to legend, this causes the person who is speaking bad about you to bite his or her tongue and negative thoughts to drift away. Number 11, never give someone a pair of scissors or knives or you will run the risk of suddenly ending any relationship with that person. Number 12, are you ready to celebrate the new year? On December 31st, eat 12 grapes before midnight and according to legend, the next 12 months will bring happiness to your life. Do any of these superstitions we mentioned sound familiar to you? Superstitions sometimes cross borders. They exist in one form or another in many countries. It is up to each of us to believe in them or not. Tell us below what superstition you most believe in. And stay tuned for next week's edition of Feedback Learnix, where we'll talk about witches.
Feedback Learning. English Forever. Estamos en sintonía. Feedback Learning. English Forever. English Forever.